Hi, this is Kerry with Multicopter Warehouse, and a lot of people have been asking us about the audio quality on the DJI Osmo Pocket. So I figured we'd do a couple tests today and see what the difference is going to be. First, we're indoors. Uh, it's a kind of a small room here, and I don't have any ambient noise at the moment. No refrigerator running or, or heater running, but there's... There's definitely a little echo in here because of the size of the room. So this would be your typical vlogger setup, uh, talking to it. The microphone is on the back of the unit. It's not on the front. So if you're trying to record someone else and get their audio, that is just not going to do it. Uh, the microphone is on the back where the screen and the controls are. So you would have to flip it around and have the microphone pointed at somebody. Or in this case, it's pointed back at me because I'm looking at the screen. Now, it's just a tiny little hole. It's not a, a, a big microphone element or anything. So the audio is never going to be that good. Now, it's just a tiny little microphone that's built in to the unit. So you can't expect fantastic audio. But you're going to get decent audio depending on the situation. So now my heater just turned on, so that might be picked up as well. Now the big thing with any microphone is distance to the speaker's mouth. The closer it is, the better it's going to sound. Now right now, I'm I have the, the Osmo sitting down and it is exactly full arm's length away. This would be a very typical scenario for a vlogger to try and get the, the best field of view uh, on the image. Now, in terms of audio quality, the closer the better. So if I come in real nice and close, the audio is actually gonna sound pretty good. But if I back up and get further away, the audio is gonna sound pretty poor. So there's definitely a sweet spot in there where the audio is going to sound its best. So next, we're gonna go outside and do some tests out there and see what the audio is going to be like in a more ambient environment. I'm very close to an airport and, and streets, so there should be plenty of background noise as well. So let's head outside and see what it's like out there. Well, now we're outside taking a little walk on this uh, 20 degree morning. We'll see how it is out here. There's quite a bit of ambient noise. I'm not that far from an airport, so I hear noise over here. I've got car noise going on. There'll be a car passing me right now. So we'll see how that works out. Uh, I am trying to keep it not quite, that's fully extended away from my arm to get the best field of view, but I have a feeling the audio is not gonna be that good. If I bring it in a little closer, we should get some better audio but the field of view is a little tight for doing vlogging. So that's my outdoor test and we'll get back inside and uh, see how these compare. So I hope this has helped you uh, to understand the capabilities of the microphone on the DJI Osmo Pocket. Now, up until this point, all the audio has been straight out of the camera, no editing, no post-production. Next, um, starting now, this is enhanced audio. So I've ran some noise reduction plugins, some anti-reverb to try and get the audio sounding as good as possible. There should be a very noticeable difference. So it is possible to clean up the audio pretty easily uh, just using some basic tools that are pretty much in every video editing software. So while it's not bad in some situations, it's certainly easy to clean up a little bit. Now coming soon, there will be uh, modules to allow for external microphones. Uh, you could probably pick one up today in uh, any decent electronic store, just getting a USB to microphone adapter, and that should work just fine for now. You might have to figure out if you're trying to put it on a mount or sitting on a table, you might have to figure something out because the port is on the bottom of the Osmo Pocket. Uh, another option might be, and this is, we got to still play around with this option, is to record to your phone 
and have a Bluetooth microphone or some other microphone going into your phone. So there should be a couple different microphone options coming in the very near future, but we'll have to see how they all tend to work out. So for now, people want to know what's it like right out of the box. Here's your answer, and hopefully this has uh, done it for you. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe and click the bell icon to be notified whenever we do new videos, and like and share this if you so desire. Thanks for watching. We will catch you next time. Bye-bye.